welcome everyone in this video lecture we will solve a cat question which is based on the current density in the silicon okay so this was the get question in that question it is given the concent the concentration of electron in a sample of uniformly dot n type silicon so what we have to do for the first time the concentration of electron in a sample of uniformly uniformly dot n type silicon at 300 kelvin varies linearly from 10 to the power 17 per centimeter cube at x equals to 0 to 6 into 10 to the power 16 per centimeter cube at x equals to 2 micrometer. So what we have to do? So first we have to make some diagram for it. Okay. So suppose this one is some means silicon bar we can say and it is n type so the majority charge carrier is our electron so i am making some electron as a majority charge carrier you can also if you want to make it so this one is the bar okay and at x equals to zero the concentration of the electron in this one is how much 10 to the power 17 per centimeter cube and at x equals to x at this point okay at this point this concentration at x equals to x we can say the concentration is given 6 into 10 to the power 16 per centimeter cube okay so in this question we have to find the current density okay so current density is denoted by j for the time being j so current density so current density is well simply the area current by area okay so this current density current by area is what so current having unit ampere and area either meter square or centimeter square so but here in our option that is centimeter square term so better to write centimeter square so our current unit will be this one ampere centimeter square so now in any silicon bar or any semiconductor material the current density that is our j due to electron okay and it may be governed by the two mechanism current density due to the diffusion one diffusion one or plus the current density due to the drift one okay so first we have to think about some theory diffusion so if we are telling about the diffusion so if there is a concentration of electron concentration of electron in the vertical electron in the vertical y direction or y direction this one and this one is x so the concentration will be decrease okay from higher to lower okay so in that case and in the drift one in the drift one it is due to the electric field and and in the question it is clearly mentioned clearly mentioned that uh, to keep the concentration gradient constant we have supplied some electron in this bar in the absence of electric field in the absence of electric field so this line is very important when we are saying this in the absence of electric field so if absence of electric field is there so this drift one due to the flow of electron or hole if we think about the pn junction diode pn material pn semiconductor so this term will be zero because it is already mentioned that the diffusion diffusion will be exist and the drift will be not possible because the electric field is zero so one more line i want to say so the current density due to the diffusion one can be written as the charge then the diffusivity due to electron and the other term dn by dx this slope dn by dx slope some slope okay 
and the other term why we are eliminating this jn because the due to the electric field the current density is somehow q then we have to write the mu n okay mu n the electron density electron concentration and the electron okay so this one is the thing so now we have already mentioned that this e is zero so the current density is only due to the diffusion one so we have to write q dn dn by dx okay so now this concentration it changes with the x okay concentration changes with the x so for a timing for x equals to 0 some concentration is there and x equals to x so now we have to solve this one so what is the unit ampere centimeter square okay so you just write q so q charge is not given so you have to write what should be the charge value so the charge value will be 1.6 into 10 to the power minus 19 coulomb okay so i am writing like that coulomb okay into dn the diffusivity term or diffusion constant that is our 35 centimeter square per second okay so one can write also the unit also it is very important so i am writing c for coulomb here okay it is not showing but c is for coulomb and 35 centimeter square per second why i am writing i will tell you 35 centimeter square per second into dn by dx so dn by dx is nothing but simply the di different derivative term so at x equals to x the what is the concentration at x equals to x at time at distance 2 equal micro it is 6 into 10 to the power 16 so we have to write this as a 6 into 10 to the power 16 minus 10 to the power 17 the difference divided by at what what is the dis, uh, for distance 2 micron so 2 so it should be 2 into 10 to power minus 4 i am writing in centimeter okay minus 0 okay clear this one this one is simply our dn by dx dn due to x1 6 into 6 into 10 to power 16 minus 10 to power 17 then this one okay and it having unit the upper num numerator having unit centimeter a square this one the concentration one per centimeter cube okay here we can write this one as a centimeter a square and one more unit that is our this one centimeter so it should be 1 by centimeter cube okay so okay so for for the time being for i am writing here the unit so why i am writing coulomb into centimeter square second this is just i am showing how to think about the units also because it is very important 1 by centimeter cube okay this one 1 by centimeter cube minus 1 by centimeter cube unit into the this one distance is also in centimeter so right centimeter so this centimeters this one cancel so it should be centimeter centimeter so we can write coulomb okay then per second centimeter square okay but it is not a unit of uh, what current density so you just write c is nothing but simply coulomb coulomb so it should be q is there q q having unit q so we can write q s centimeter square and one can also write this q as a it q equals to it then second centimeter square okay now t having unit second so this second this second cancel so it should be ampere by centimeter this this one just i have written uh, for the knowledge purpose means how it is a unit how we have to think about the uh, unit so now we have to solve this one so it should be 1.6 into 10 to the power 19 now i am not writing the unit 35 into take the common 10 to the power 16 common 
so we can write 6 minus 10 okay divided by 2 into 10 to the power minus 4 okay so after that what we can write this one 1.6 into 10 to the power minus 19 into 35 into 10 to the power 16 into minus 4 divided by 2 into 10 to the power minus 4 now we can say 2 and it should be 2 okay so now if we cancel this uh, decimal then it should be 10 here then 10 to the power minus 4 and this one 10 to the power minus 3 and then 10 to the power 3 so this one this one this one and this one should be cancelled so what we have to what we get 16 into 35 into 2 these two with a minus sign so i am writing this minus here okay minus sign will be there okay so now our answer will be minus 32 into 35 so multiply 32 and 35 35 and 32 so 10 then 6 okay 5 okay 10 15 then 9 and so then it should be 1 okay so it should be around cent yeah, so right ampere per centimeter square not because our unit is ampere centimeter square so this one is clear the 70 and then 105 then this one is the answer so this is all about the solution for the current density so the answer will be our b okay so i am just highlighting the answer will be our b okay so we have to write this formula first electron density due to both diffusion and drift so now electric field is absent so this this part will be not come in the problem okay so we can write this d q d and t n by dx and with the concentration of that electron at x equals to 0 and x equals to 2 micro meter so we have solved this one step by step so after that we can get the final result minus 11 20 ampere per centimeter square so this is all about the question uh, solution for this so thank you for watching and please also subscribe my channel